about to start a three week mega tour in the Americas. So first I'm going to Boston, then Toronto, then to San Francisco, then back to Toronto, and then I'm going home. So let's do this. <laughs> It's like 3.20 in the morning and um, we all had to evacuate the hotel room and they told us the reason was that someone's room was leaking and it was tripping the fire alarm. Dude, I just got here, like... So, yeah, kind of tired. I'm gonna go meet Mike and, uh, and Yvonne for breakfast uh, this week in Boston. Uh, we're working on our NASA project. We're basically gonna do a bunch of meetings and um, I'll share as much of that as I can for this week. So let's go do it. Okay, yeah, of close. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say? Face. <laughs> I'll talk about myself briefly first. Get some good context. No oh God. Um, yeah. So I used to work out of our San Francisco office. Um, I was an intern before I graduated college, and then came back to pilot a rotation program. Um, but worked in our gallery primarily, developing a gallery workshop program and curating customer stories, um, and then really wanted to work in the build space. He just opened officially in October, so fairly new. One interesting thing to note about the building, this is the Innovation and Design Building. Um, it's a new up and coming area in Boston. Boston, you know, little known fact, is the epicenter for architecture and construction in North America. <laughs> So this is actually the end of the day, but I didn't get a chance to explain some of the stuff I was doing earlier on. And uh, I'm also shooting this for Snapchat at the same time because, you know, reasons. What you're about to see is basically a little trip we took to a place called uh, Mentis Science Instruments. They make a bunch of incredible stuff. They do medical technologies, they do defense technologies. And we went to see them to see if there was some stuff that would help us with our NASA project. Um, I'm doing this at the beginning. I know this is a bit longer than it should be, but in the past, like sometimes I forget to do this bit where I'm explaining what I'm actually doing. And instead I try to put like a lazy title card in. Um, so I'm gonna try and shoot these in the hotel room at the end of the day if I forget, and that way at least I've got it and I can put it in the video. So this isn't strange at all. I'm talking at the camera and also I got these on, so I'm talking to a different group of camera. This is, this is too much. <laughs> Day one is over. We're getting seafood. They're doing real work, and I'm just doing my stuff for the YouTubes. So. And I've just solved the problem of space. So she I'm just, just like, she just solved, yeah. So, 
Yvonne has been on the on the on, on the YouTubes before on, on this channel, but I didn't give her a proper introduction last time. So Yvonne is a space surgeon and astronaut and um, was a field me field medic? Uh, flight, flight medic. Surgeon. Flight surgeon. Yeah. <laughs> um, Basically, if you want to feel like an underachiever, you hang out with Yvonne. That's, that's <laughs> kind of the thing. Or you need uh, various body parts that need to be stitched together and then <laughs> evac'd out, you know. I can do the medevac for you. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of like putting the watch back together and finding an extra piece of stuff. <laughs> so that's Yvonne. <laughs> And Yvonne gives us problems worth solving. Yeah, that's a very good, yeah. That's a good, yeah. I like that. Yeah. Anyway, we're eating dinner, so bye. <laughs> it's day two. I'm having breakfast. Well, I'm having breakfast, they're not. And we're going to go to MIT. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be good. That is Mike Aubrey's work face. <laughs> <laughs> All these awesome things you're doing with textiles. <laughs> Wanted to brainstorm with who do you think the best people are to talk to on that. We gotta get more education. We're at the Media Lab, MIT. We have some cool stuff. Fantastic mural over there. We found Tana Reed. It's another teammate, but he's leaving soon because he's gonna go and join MIT because he's super smart. Well, that's questionable. <laughs> so, we're on our way back to the build space. We're gonna do a debrief on what we just talked about at MIT, and then um, yeah, it's gonna be super exciting writing reports. Are they enjoying the garbage on the back seat? That's gotta be a great. Oh yeah, Tanner's car is also. A Arguably <laughs> a dumpster or a portal to Narnia. So <laughs> I found. I mean, I'm just shaming you on YouTube uh, now. You should get the shit. <laughs> That's sad. There's also a, there's like a literal, life, literal tire in the back seat. <laughs> I haven't been able to lift it out of the car. <laughs> to be fair, to in his defense, Tan Tano, Tano's like. Doubt hurt himself really badly recently, so we're not gonna hold it against him. But it is just too funny, and it it's so perfectly Tanner. It's <laughs> just the stories you have, man. They're like the best. Tanner no, just be wants great. everyone to know that he's going to MIT, <laughs> so he's put it on his windshield. Is it? Is it? So I think day two is kind of over. Uh, we just did a lot of session planning, execution strategy, MIT stuff. There's the very clean whiteboard where there was some very cool drawings just a minute ago, but you know. Um, and now Mike Aubrey is taking a portrait of my ridiculous selfie yeah, stick great. system. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna go get some food and call it a day. Great. <laughs> Peace. Day three. Back at MIT. Look at these columns. Basically, at this point, we're, pre we're pretending that we go here. No, we're <laughs> here to talk materials. So yeah. As you can see, there's a lot of materials that are used in this very <laughs> building. Like stone. We're going to use that as an attention getting over for today's presentation. Yes. Look around you, everything you see materials. <laughs>